this video, I'm going to take you through setting up remote access for your Nodebox. As it stands, your Nodebox is only accessible if you're on your home network, either wired or on Wi-Fi. But what if you wanted to take your laptop out and connect using an internet connection elsewhere? There's a few options to do this, but the one I'm going to go through is using Tailscale. It's free, open source, and is an encrypted service that allows you to remote in. It uses the WireGuard protocol to achieve this. Now, I would recommend that you uh, read through the privacy policy. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do is log into my notebox on my dashboard and head on over to the terminal section. And I'm going to go to the downloads page um, of Tailscale and I'm going to copy, or click on the Linux tab and copy this and paste that through like so. and put in my password. Okay, the next thing uh, is to connect your machine to the Tailscale network and authenticate in your browser. But before I do that, what I'm gonna do is um, create an account with Tailscale. So I'll go back and we'll go get started. And you can log in with any of these. Um, you can also use an anonymous GitHub account, which I'm going to use here. And I'll just log in. And authorize Tailscale. Okay, and what we'll do is go back to those instructions. Um, that were contained in the data, uh, in the downloads page, and type in this, copy this, and paste that in like so. Okay, and you'll get this to authenticate, visit this link here. So I'm just gonna copy this link here, and I'm going to open up a new tab, and since I'm already logged in, hopefully, yep, so then I can hit the connect button like so and your device notebox has been logged in. Perfect. And you'll see the success in your uh, terminal there as well. So that'll then refresh you through and your notebox IP is now 100.107.252.79. So from here, you'll need to add your second device, which is either your laptop, your mobile phone, or any other device uh, that you wish to use. I'm just going to use my existing PC. Um, so I'm going to open up a terminal in uh, my normal computer, um, which is the Linux machine that I'm on right now, and I'm going to install that. You can install it for Windows, Mac, Android, iPhone, so on and so forth. But for me, it's going back to this. So let's install that. And sudo tailscale up. Okay, and I need to use this link here. So we'll copy this and paste that in. And so now I'm going to add in a device called Tower of Terror. So we'll connect to that. And it'll say success. Um, and now uh, I should be able to connect um, through to uh, this notebox here. So when I go into my Sparrow wallet, I'll go File, uh, Preferences, and Edit the Server. I'll edit the existing connection. And instead of notebox.local, which you will have, um, I'm going to use the notebox IP address here. Uh, so I'm going to copy this one here, and I'm going to paste that through. And I'm going to hit Test Connection and you'll see that that's now been connected. So now it won't matter whether or not I'm connected to uh, my home network. Um, I can be anywhere in the world and still be able to connect through to this IP address as long as I'm connected to the Tailscale VPN on whatever machine that I have installed it on and given it uh, auth authentication to in my uh, dashboard here. You can even install it on your mobile phone. So download and install Tailscale and click on connect and press okay. And then you can log in using those credentials and hit the connect button. Login successful. 
notifications and you'll see um, the Google Pixel now in. So from here, uh, once you're connected to that VPN, uh, you can open up Blue Wallet uh, and go into the network settings and Electrum server. And instead of the Bitaroo, um, we, we can put in, so we'll do nodebox.tail 493ea.ts.net uh, with port 5001. Don't use SSL and hit save. Your changes have been saved. So we need to restart uh, Blue Wallet and we'll open up Blue Wallet again. And we'll go into the network settings and you'll see that you are connected to your own node box um, using this address of your node box. Uh, and you can notice that I'm not on uh, my Wi-Fi, I'm on my 5G and I'm just connected to the Tailscale VPN. So that's how I can remotely access my node uh, from anywhere in the world. Thanks for watching. And if you'd like to support the work that I'm doing, head on over to ministryofnodes.com.au and click on the support button. If you'd like to have one-on-one -on -one consulting, click on the consulting button and book a session on the calendar widget. And if you'd like to purchase a Bitcoin node, head on over to the shop and purchase one from shop.ministryofnodes.com. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.